have to rely on technology. You, it, it, it makes good sense. But for me still, the, the use of a technology, the acid test is, is it going to allow me to have better interactions in the class. But it does open up new doors, and once you open those doors, you see things. For example, we used to do at the beginning of a tutorial, um, a little quiz, just to make sure the students had come to the class prepared. Um, the TAs would collect the quizzes, they'd mark the quizzes, they'd have to put these into a, a, you know, a grade book that we would deal with later on. Well, if you really stop to think about it, I said, Let's, this time's too precious. Let's move this to online quizzes. Okay? And, the, and the response might be, well, if you have online quizzes, they're going to work with each other. And you go, bingo, all of a sudden we got our students doing cooperative learning. They're now, sure, maybe four of them are standing around together doing that quiz, but then they've got to go to the next person's quiz and the next person's quiz, and now all of those students are coming to class prepared, and they work together doing it. So we say, sure, you can do your quizzes online cooperatively, make that the standard. And so now we find ourselves doing these kinds of online quizzes even in courses that wouldn't absolutely have to have them because it just turns out to be a great way to do sort of, you know, the simple work so that you can spend your quality, precious tutorial time actually with engaging in the deeper level sort of, you know, dynamics that you want to be doing.